French President Emmanuel Macron's visit to the Alps this Thursday comes against a backdrop of ongoing strikes against the government's controversial pension reform plan, as well as violent protests against building uh, water reservoirs in hundreds of locations across the country. French protesters were called to gather across uh, France this Thursday evening to voice their fury against these escalating clashes. On Saturday, more than 25,000 people gathered in the rural town of saint -Soli in southwestern France to protest the construction of these so-called mega basins, claiming they will harm the already depleted rivers and biodiversity in the area. The protest became quickly marred with violence with more than 200 people injured. One person lost an eye after being hit by a projectile and two other men were still in a coma as of Thursday morning, according uh, to the organizers of this protest. But the big controversy now is whether law enforcement hit the intervention of emergency medical services. In a recording released by uh, the French newspaper Mediapart in coordination with the French Human Rights League, uh, well, we can hear a telephone exchange between a lawyer and an emergency responder. The responder explains that no helicopter or ambulance can enter the zone due to an order issued by law enforcement. Take a listen. Vous avez, vous en êtes où là du, du, de, la, de la plus grosse urgence absolue de, de, de ce que j'ai comme impression moi de loin? Ouais, mais en fait, sur... On a eu un médecin sur place qui a expliqué la situation, c'est qu'on n'enverra pas des micros ou de moyens de sur place parce qu'on n'a pas en place pour envoyer par les forces de l'ordre. Ok. Est-ce que... Voilà. Est que euh, alors moi, je suis avec des observateurs de la Ligue des droits de l'homme qui disent que euh, leurs observateurs sur place euh, disent que c'est calme depuis 30 minutes et que donc il est possible d'intervenir. Je suis d'accord avec vous, vous n'êtes pas le premier à nous le dire. Le problème, c'est que c'est à l'appréciation des, des, des forces de l'ordre et qu'on est sous le... The National Gendarmerie, the branch of the armed uh, forces of France that intervened during saint soline uh, claimed that these accusations were fake news. On Twitter, they insisted uh, that they helped with evacuations and had their medical team help injured protesters. In a report about Saturday's clash, the director general of the Gendarmerie even described the use of force as proportionate. Meanwhile, the parents of the two men uh, in a coma filed complaints on Wednesday accusing law enforcement of attempted murder.